Hello friends, I am Aparna Kulkarni. In this video, we will discuss another concept uh, in stereochemistry, types of strains in an organic molecule. Now you know that uh, due to rotation around carbon-carbon single bond, molecule could attain various arrangements in space called as conformations. Stabilities of these conformations depends upon various strains associated with them. So let's first understand concept of strains. A strain means a discomfort. Uh, imagine you are trying to lift a very heavy box. You will experience uh, pain means discomfort in the back. Likewise, molecule due to their arrangement in space experience some discomfort. We call it as strain. Uh, there are basically uh, four types of strains in a molecule. Uh, Van der Waals or steric strain, Pisa or torsional strain, transannular strain and Bayes strain or angle strain. Uh, let us see how each type of strain arise in a molecule. So first is Van der Waals or steric strain. Every atom in a molecule has an effective radius around it with respect to atom with which it is not bonded. Uh, let us consider uh, Sohos projection of ethane. Here I have shown two non-bonded hydrogens by a blue circle. Uh, this uh, blue circle uh, represents uh, Van der Waals radius. These are two non-bonded atoms as they are on adjacent carbon atoms. If uh, two such atoms come very close, means closer than some of their Van der Waals radius, then they strongly repel each other. Uh, this repulsion between non-bonded atoms is called as Van der Waals or steric strain. Let me give you one example. Uh, consider a person sitting on a couch. Now, uh, suppose uh, the same uh, space is to be shared by two persons then what will happen they will experience strain likewise molecule uh, due to small space uh, experience strain which is called as steric strain next is torsional strain uh, torsional strain is the repulsion that arises between atoms or group of atoms when a molecule is rotated around a sigma bond here i have shown uh, Newman projection of uh, ethane and this is eclipsed conformation. Now suppose um, I rotate back carbon through 60 degree, I will get staggered conformation of ethane. Uh, okay, uh, now as you can see in uh, eclipsed conformation, all the uh, CH bonds and all hydrogen atoms are facing each other. So there will be maximum torsional strain, but in uh, staggered conformation, all CH bonds are apart and all hydrogen atoms uh, are at distance. So there will be minimum torsional strain in staggered conformation. Uh, you may get confused between steric strain and torsional strain. So uh, quick revision. Steric strain is the repulsion between two atoms or group of atoms when distance between them is decreased. Whereas Torsional strain is the repulsion that arises between two atoms or group of atoms when a molecule is rotated around sigma bond. Okay. So let's go to next uh, strain, type of strain, transannular strain. This is special type of uh, steric strain. Uh, this generally uh, found in large ring system in such compounds. Sometimes the groups attached to the opposite sides of the rings come closer due to their non-planar conformation. Uh, let's imagine this structure. This is boat conformation of cyclohexane. Uh, now you can see that uh, hydrogen atom on carbon number 1 and hydrogen atom on carbon number 4 uh, are uh, close to each other. So, if this distance is very close, means closer than some of their Van der Waals radius, then there will be steric repulsion. So, this boat conformation will experience transannular strain. This is called as transannular strain. Uh, 
the last type of the strain is wear strain or angle strain. The strain that arise in a cyclic compounds due to deviation from normal tetrahedral bond angle is called as uh, wear strain or angle strain. Uh, you know that in normal sp3 carbon, uh, the bond angle is 109.5 degree. When the carbon-carbon bond angle is near to 109, molecule is at comfort. But in uh, cyclic compounds, for example, cyclopropane or cyclobutane, uh, molecule has to attain uh, different carbon-carbon bond angles. So, as you can see, in cyclopropane, it is 60 degree. In cyclobutane, it is 90 degree. So, uh, this will uh, impose strain in the molecule and this strain is called as angle strain. In next video, we will discuss uh, more about angle strain, uh, bear strain theory in detail. If you find this video useful, do like and share the video and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.